How's work? Ah, it's busy. Look good. How about your work? I'm a patent lawyer, Greg. Most exciting part of my day is when I get to go to the bathroom. Yeah, but at least you got that stand-up thing going for you. Yeah, I haven't been going. Are you serious? Well, I've been going, but I just haven't been getting on stage. Well, that's like going to Hooters and getting takeout. Would you get takeout from Hooters? Man, what if your mom was working? Dude, my mom's dead. I know. I'm sorry, could you please explain that again? Claim one in encoding step that is all shown by Suzuki prior art reference. In figure four, I must go. Goodbye. Well, that went well. Can you write up an interview summary that we can send to the client? I'm not even sure that was the patent examiner. Well, just so that we can both bill for this, let's assume that it was. <laughs> well, I seriously have no idea what she just said, so I'm not sure what to put in the summary. Well, you know, just keep it really generic that we discuss the rejections generally and keep out on all the sexual stuff that she brought up. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Actually, I couldn't understand a word she was saying, so it is possible. <laughs> we need to get this letter out ASAP. Thanks, Brian. So, how are you doing? <sighs> I'm tired. I was out late on a blind date last night with a grandpa. He was like, 38, something so gross, weird. Crap, Nikki, I'm in my 30s. That makes me feel old. You know it would make you look younger. An assistant that was older than me? You're hilarious. You need to go to that salon that I've been telling you about. You could look 20 years younger. Rumor is Donny Osmond goes there, and for Grandpa, he's pretty hot. Yeah, my wife would agree with you on that. Actually, can you get me an appointment? Uh, did you need help with something? I noticed in your email this morning you changed your signature block to paralegal instead of assistant. Yeah. Well, I mean, I do all the same things that paralegals do, so I think I should be called a paralegal. Well, that might be true, but you need to get firm approval for anything like that. Anyway, I just didn't want you getting in trouble with HR. Okay. Thanks. You know 150 billable hours per month is a minimum, right? To be on shareholder track, you need to hit 2,000 hours per year, which is about 170 per month. I'd have to practically live here to do that. If you're going to be one of these lifestyle attorneys, you need to move in with Judith and get her over with. I want to be a shareholder. Plus, I already have a room at Mother's. Why can't I call myself a paralegal? Because you're not one. How do I get the firm to make me a paralegal? Ask Wes, he'll know, plus I don't care. Have Wes and Judith been having lunches and meetings that they're trying to keep secret? Not that I know of. They're meeting behind closed doors. That's usually what happens right before somebody leaves the firm. Wes can't leave. He's the only one here at the firm I can stand. Well, you've known Wes forever. If he was going to leave, he would tell you first, wouldn't he? Yeah, Wes would tell you first. He wouldn't just leave. If Wes is sneaking around with Judith, I'll never forgive him. Maybe they're doing it. No, sorry, bad joke. They couldn't do it. I mean, technically they could, but I'll stop talking. Oh my gosh, there's always somebody fantasizing about one of their co-workers in the office. Hi. I have an appointment. Oh, are you Nikki's boss? Yeah. And you're the one that likes Dunny Osmond, right? No. I mean, my wife does, but... <laughs> okay. 
Jade, your appointment is here. One word. Yummy. Jade will be right out. Present. <laughs> Hi, nice to meet you, Jade. Let's get you over to my station so I can get my hands on you. Let me give you a stress relieving treatment to help you relax. So damn good. Your work is gonna be all over this. What? What did you do to your hair? Did you color your eyebrows? Well, I just had my hair done. I thought my eyebrows looked a little different. Are you going to an audition for The King and I? Hey, Mom, can you sign this for school? Sure. Hey, cutie. Thanks, Mom. Bye, Dad. Well, maybe it's just you and other people will like it. <laughs> That's over for 2. Well, Jade liked it. Jade? Did you get your hair cut at a strip club? Holy crap, they literally tried to make me look like Donny Osmond. Based on what I'm seeing, I don't think they have any idea what he looks like. Can we fix this? Can you help me scrub this out? Why did you let her do it? Well, Nikki said I'd look 20 years younger, and I really didn't know what Jade was doing. She had big boobs, didn't she? What? No. Yeah, I mean, it depends on what you think big is. Like, they weren't double Ds, probably like a D C. I don't know. Who notices stuff like that? We all notice boobs. We just don't let them pick our eyebrow color for us. Hey, Steve. Oh, hey, Brian. I'm super excited about our Harry Potter night. I rented Goblet of Fire, and then after that, we can brainstorm fan fiction ideas. And my mom, she made us butterbeer and cupcakes. Uh, about that, I don't think I can make it tonight. I'm really sorry. What? I've been looking forward to this for a month. Me too. I'm just behind on my hours at work, and these partners are really breaking my sorcerer's stones. Can, can we push it to tomorrow night, maybe? Come on, Brian. You know you need it. Okay, I, I'll see if I can try to make it work. Mischief managed. Remember, you must not tell lies. Again? Okay, you start scrubbing your hair and eyebrows with this stuff. Especially your eyebrows. Isn't this for dishes? Are you sure you just don't want to run me through the dishwasher? I googled it and that's what they said. Dish soap. But, in case it doesn't work, I'm gonna run down to the drugstore and see what I can find there.
to your eyebrows, they're so red. They look raw. What do you mean? I've been scrubbing just like you said, and it isn't working. Well, this will work. The lady at the drugstore said that she's used this before and that it works for bad color treatments. This says can cause blindness. I'm sure that's never happened. Just shut your eyes really tight. You'll be fine. Holy crap! All I'm seeing are rough shapes and colors right now. Really? Yeah. How did it get in my eyes? I was holding this thing so freaking tight. Just relax. You're fine. I'm sure it's because you've been pressing on your eyes so hard. Are you sure? Yes. Your eyes will go back to normal. Just give it a minute. On the bright side, your hair and eyebrows look way better. Well, I'm not sure it was worth me trading my eyesight for. Well, that's what you get for getting your hair cut by a big boobed beautician named Jade. Oh, I think it might be getting just a little bit better. I don't know, I've just been feeling... I mean, my dad told me I wanted to be a lawyer when I was 14, and I believed him. I've been doing it for like 20 years now. My life is half over. I should confess something. I've started doing something, something I've always wanted to do. I mean, it's not illegal or weird. No, it's, it's kind of weird. But I feel like I have to do it. It's like a calling. I just, I have to. Anne? Are you still in here? Anne? I can see again. What? Are you kidding me? I get... I think it's from all the scrubbing. Yeah, scrubbing with that industrial strength paint remover. I can't miss work today either. I've got this important client meeting with Reed. I think I can fix that. Really? Okay, so here's the mail that has to go out today. What in the crap happened to your face? What are you talking about? Uh, well, your eyes are all puffy and it looks like you've been up all night crying. Are you on your period? I'll go get the tampons. Actually, I might be. Can I explain later? But you have to tell me later. I will. Okay. Oh, wait, can I call myself a paralegal? I mean, I do all the same things that paralegals do. Well, the firm has to change your title officially. And paralegals, they have billable hour requirements. So if you work with anybody with lower hours, they're not going to want you to be taking billable work from them. You mean Brian? Not necessarily. I mean, it could be, yeah, in the IP section, I mean Brian. So you'll have a billable hour requirement, but if you're interested in that, let me know and I'll talk to the firm. Let me think about it. Okay. Okay. What are you smiling about? Your, your face. It's so fetched up right now. It's like... Oh, Nikki, I'm glad you're here. Wes, Nikki wants to get on the paralegal track. What the hell happened to your face? You look like a victim of domestic violence. You know, that might not be far from the truth. So what happened? Yeah, just tell us. All right, fine. <laughs> okay. Well, okay, there must have been some kind of mix up because my friend Michelle was supposed to do you. No. Jade did me, and not in a good way either. Dang it. Jade. That sounds like a stripper's name. You know, I don't really like you in makeup. It's weird. What's going on here? I mean, you wouldn't keep a secret from me now, would you? No, no, of course not. Hey, about that client meeting today, I'm not feeling very well. I got a case of the Rocky Mountain two-step, and I kind of need to stick close to the bathroom. Uh, they postponed until next week.
He didn't notice anything, did he? <laughs> no, but you may want to ask him if you could borrow one of his adult diapers. <laughs> Rocky Mountain Two Step. You just told him that story though to get out of the meeting, right? Like you're not. Right, right. You know? I'd never go to a client meeting with this much makeup on. <laughs> of course. <laughs> You know, these girls at the firm, Brian, they're always keeping secrets and causing trouble. What girls? One thing you need to watch for, Brian. Nikki. She's trying to take billable hours away from you. What? How? If she becomes a paralegal, she'll start taking billable work from others in the IP section, which means you. But she can't do that. I'm barely making it as it is. You've got to put her in her place. She's just a secretary. Secretary. Nikki, uh, a client needs something faxed over and I let them know that I would have my secretary do it. I'm a legal assistant, not a secretary. Well, that's still not a paralegal. And what exactly is that supposed to mean? I'm sure you'll figure it out. Forget about the paralegal track. I've decided I don't need the extra stress right now. Okay. Okay. I got this. No one scares me. I am hilarious. Starting today, I'm a stand-up comedian. And if you don't like it, screw you. Screw you. Screw you. Yes, I can do it! Yes! Do it, do it! I know you can do it, don't be a Come on! Do it! Do it! I'm gonna do it, yes! Sorry about that, that was... Okay. Hey, how do you get this makeup off? This washcloth isn't really working. Oh, here, use this makeup remover. Okay. So, here, here, under. Okay. Here, under. Like that. Okay. Over, over, under. under. Oh, that's starting to work. That's good. <laughs> 